Hey guys, what's up? So World of Warcraft makes hundreds and hundreds of mounts. But did you guys know there's some mounts that they actually made that are in the database, but they were just never released? So today I'm going to show you guys five mounts that were put into the game, but they never made them available for the players. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get into the list. Coming in at number five, the Blue Skeleton War Horse. So this mount was actually um, never implemented in the game. It exists in the database just like all the other mounts. This mount was actually uh, a mount for the Lady of the Four Horsemen in Oxramas. So because it was never brought out, maybe it was supposed to be a mount drop that uh, that just never uh, they never got around to putting in. But um, if you guys want to see this mount in game. Go to Nox Ramas, fight the four horsemen, and you guys will see it there. Coming in at number four, the Primal Leopard. Now, this was a mount that was grouped up with a lot of different cats. There was a tiger and so on, but I'm not going to show you all, all of them. This one was unique, so I wanted to talk about this one today. It was going to be an alliance-only mount, so I could imagine it was for a um, maybe uh, the Night Elves when they first uh, created this mount. Like I said, this... Um, this is in the database, but it was just never released, and I really wish it was because it's an awesome looking mount. Number three, the Golden Water Strider. Now, we do have water striders in the game, but this is one of four water striders that actually have been listed in the database since of uh, Mista Pandaria. Um, it's just, uh, it was never released, and I, I wish they would have released this one because it has a cool color and... The more mounts in the game, the more people are going to be hunting. And you just get more mounts. You can't get better than that, you know? Coming in at number two, the Black Dragon Hawk mount. Now, this mount is in the game, just not this color of the mount. You can see this mount in game, though, because there are NPCs that have the color of this mount, but it was just never implemented um, into World of Warcraft for players to ride around on the black dragon hawk mount. I'm not sure why. I'm sure there was a place for it to put it um, in the Burning Crusades, but for some reason they just chose not to uh, implement it into the game. And coming in at number one, the Swift Spellfire Carpet. Now, this carpet was actually added during um, Wrath of the Lich King in the beta test, but they removed it and they... Um, Never brought it back to the game. I'd imagine it was uh, for tailors anyway. So, uh, you know, only one of my characters would have been able to ride around on this. But I think it's cool. I love the idea of the carpets. They're pretty plain, but I think there's a lot of stuff they can do with them. And I hopefully they, uh, they figure out a few different ways to actually implement uh, some of these mounts back into the game. Because we all love mount hunting. Alright guys, so there's five mounts that you may not have known about. I thought they were pretty cool. I love seeing all the stuff that's actually um, made for World of Warcraft, but is never brought into the game. I can only imagine some of the stuff that they have created that they're just thinking about putting in. And hopefully they do. Alright guys, if you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Make sure to like the video. I have a lot of other videos on different subjects, from guides to top fives to top tens. Hopefully you guys enjoy them, and I'll talk to you guys soon.